If you want notifications from the smart devices in your automated home, the easiest way to set them up is using Hubitat Elevation's built-in notifications app. Sure, you could use Rule Machine, but why would you want to when notifications makes it so much easier? So let's do a quick walkthrough of setting up a notification. Start by going to the Apps tab, and if you haven't already, load the notifications app. When you open the app, create a new notifier. I want to be notified when my son is trying to steal my booze, so we'll name this Liquor Cabinet Breach. Now we need to select the type of device we want to be notified about. There's a really long list here. Most of your devices should be included. One cool thing is battery level. You can be notified when a battery is running low on any of your devices. You can choose to be notified of mode changes. I have a hidden contact sensor in my liquor cabinet door. So for this notification, we're going to select contact sensor. Then select the liquor cabinet door. Here I have some options for when I want to be notified. Based on the type of device you select, you'll have different options. For my contact sensor, I want to be notified when the door opens, so I'll select that. For how long? I want to be notified right away, so I will leave that blank. If you put, for example, 5 minutes in there, you would not be notified until the sensor was open for 5 minutes. If the door was shut during that period, the notification would be cancelled. I want to be notified every time my kid tries to sneak into my liquor cabinet, so I'm not going to set either of these restrictions. I could also have this notification repeat, which can be good if you have like a water sensor detecting a flood in your basement or something, but I'll leave it off for this one. Now that we've set our parameters, we can select how we want to be notified. You can select text, audio, or both. Let's start with text notifications. In order to receive text notifications, you need to set up your phone using the Hubitat mobile app. Once you do that, you can select your phone here. Now we'll write the message we want to send. You can write multiple messages and separate them by commas. Then turn on this slider here and it will randomly send you one of those messages when triggered. You can also use variables in the message which are indicated by putting them between percent signs. So if I did this, I will get a text that says liquor cabinet door open 417 or you know, whatever time the door was opened. Pretty slick. When our messages are set, hit done. The same principle applies to audio notifications. Put your message in here and select your devices here or here. This is great if you want to warn potential intruders and things, but for my liquor cabinet espionage, we will maintain radio silence. The last thing to do is set any restrictions on when you want your notification rule to run. So for this rule, I want these notifications to run from 1 a.m. to 10 p.m. I don't need notifications from 10 p.m. to 1 a.m. because that's when I'm in the liquor cabinet pounding Jim Beam until I pass out. You can also set a switch to disable notifications, but my son is smart enough to figure that out and then I'd never catch him, so we won't set that. And with that, we'll hit done. If you go back into your apps, you can see your new notification has been created. If you want to make any changes, just click on it and edit as you please. And don't forget to check out our community at community.hubitat.com for more help from our awesome community members. Thanks for watching and thanks for elevating your environment with Hubitat Elevation.